Hello students, I am Dr. Tanmay Vishwas and I welcome you all in my channel. Today's topic of discussion is on MCQ and the question is in front of you. I request you student please pause the video, try by yourself and whatever your answer please write in the comment box along with few words as explanation. I believe you have tried, let me start. So the question, this chlorobenzene derivative in presence of sodium hydroxide and later on workup resulted in fuel. So, what is the intermediate produced in this reaction? Carbocation, carbon ion, radical or benzyne? Or none of these. Okay, sorry, not carbon ion. Now, student, this is a mechanism based question. So, let's learn this techniques. Now, here, here actually, if I say, if you see that this chlorine is actually substituted by OH. So, you can expect that, sir, sodium hydroxide is there. So here this hydroxide acting as a nucleophile and replacing the chlorine. Student, that is not possible. Because aromatic CCL moiety or CCL bond cannot undergo SN1 or SN2. Why not SN1? Because the phenyl carbocation is unstable. It is phenyl cation, not benzylic. Don't get confused. And SN2 reaction not possible because these pi electron cloud will repel the incoming nucleophile because nucleophile is also an electron rich species. So that's why substitution is not possible by these two traditional methods SN1 and SN2. Now in this case what is possible? There is possible and another intermediate name as benzyne. So how these benzyne form? By the way this is actually remember very reactive intermediate reaction intermediate. Now if you look at the reaction condition 350 degrees centigrade 300 atmosphere temperature too much a drastic condition so under this condition this oh will behave differently so here one of the ortho hydrogen will be abstracted by this ho minus and it will generate a carbon ion so i mean the negative charge is on this sp2 hybridized orbital this orbital is sp2 hybridized agree in the next step what happens it produces benzene how so these you can expect that it will push it will leave now here this is little interesting that okay this is the benzene pi electron delocalization and this is the third bond if you look at the name benzene it means benzene plus ion triple bond. So actually here if you focus on this carbon versus this carbon you see there is a triple bond. So that is. By the way this triple bond is little different compared to typical bonding because this third bond is produced by the bent overlap. Remember this term bent overlap of these two sp2 hybridized orbitals. So their overlap integral is let, uh, less so consequently this is weaker bond and very reactive proof of the statement so you can expect that in the next step what happened this nucleophile attacks again so nucleophilic attack on triple bond or double bond this is not natural but since this bond is weaker very reactive so it will break down and produce here it is o my oh and this is c minus carbon ion by the way, this is also very reactive. So under this reaction condition, this proton will be abstracted. Why? Because each bond is significantly polar. This proton is delta positive. This is delta negative. So polar bond. So this OH or another mole, so another any which hydroxyl ion can abstract this. Not only that, this carbon ion could be quenched from the water molecule produced. See in the first step, any which abstracted this proton produce water. So anywhere this water proton can come and it can produce this phenoxide under this reaction condition. What do I mean? At the end of the first step, the product will be sodium phenoxide. So upon this acidic workup, this phenoxide will be converted into phenol. So in this way, so intermediate of this reaction is remember student, it is benzene. So the answer of this question is benzene. So I guess you have understand this question and by the way, this process, this reaction has a name. Remember, it is important. Trau Tau process where chlorobenzene is directly converted into phenol via benzene as intermediate. 
so this is the end of this discussion thanks for watching see you in my next video bye bye